What's going on guys and welcome back to the Hungry Road. Thank you for tuning in. My name is Eric. If it's your first time seeing my face, please go ahead and smash the subscribe button and like the video while you're at it. But today, we're going to go over one of the shoes I have in my collection. So I've bought, been wanting to wear. But sometimes, I'm trying to pull some new stuff out. But this is the Sometimes We Walk series here in my channel. It's just kind of like a hobby sort of thing for me. But anyway, let's get started. So today, you already see the thumbnail. We have a very cool, iconic shoe that has been remade a couple of times already. This is going to be the Nike Air Jordan 1. Now, this is called the Royal, but it's reimagined. So, in 2013, they had the original Jordan 1 Royal come out. Then again, in 2017. So, one of the big deals with these shoes was that it was all leather. If you look closely here, these have now been redone in suede. Now, as a part of the reimagined sort of theme that Nike's been doing lately, Usually there's some yellowing that happens, but this is a pretty white sole right here. Let's get the other one out of the box. There's a lot of paper in this box, but it's good. But these are an absolutely gorgeous shoe. Again, very simple design. Blue toe, blue back here. We have the white sole. Um, I like it when the Jordan 1s have like the triple color going right across here, like at the Lost and Found. You have like a Nike, at least a black Nike sign, then like a red up here and like white here. So you get like a triple layer, but this is fine with just two. Not a big deal. We do have the Wings logo up top right there. Very nice and smooth back in. These are, these come unlaced, so I do gotta lace these up. Are there more than, yes, there are more than one set of laces in here. Am I tripping? I could be tripping. Yes, we do have a set of black laces. And I see inside we have a set of blue laces. I'm probably going to do one blue, one black, just like I did with my Lost and Founds. I did one black, one white, I believe. I can't remember now. But yeah, man, this is a pretty straightforward shoe. These were November 23rd, November 18, something like that, of 2023. These were a buck 80. <laughs> now they're selling for like a buck 18. So I took a pretty big L on these. But it's fine. I wear my shoes. I'm not tripping about it at all. Yeah, back in the day, the 2013 and the 2017s, they were both 140 when they came out. So I'll show you where the cost of shoes is going. But yeah, man, really cool, clean shoe. I got a really clean outfit to go with these as well. We're going to brunch. It's going to be a good time. And uh, that's about it, man. Nothing too crazy here. Yep, can't wait to pull these out. Yeah, I like the way Jordan 1's feel on my feet and they look good on my feet too i have a wide foot but these seem to do pretty well to handle my wide foot and uh yeah man they're comfortable you can walk all day in these they're a little flat but it's fine but yeah man that's it these are the nike air jordan one royal reimagined and uh if you got yourself a pair i hope that you're wearing yours and not kicking yourself for them dropping so much in value because <laughs> some of the older ones are like 350 now like why are those 350 in these 112 because it's still sort of new i don't know anywhere guys the first time seeing my face smash subscribe subscribe button like the video there's never an empty tank or empty stomach on this road take care we are marching away toward 5,000 subscribers oh and stay tuned to next week uh when you see how i put the outfit together and my get ready with me series it's doing pretty well you guys like it y'all have start calling me unk for whatever reason <laughs> i have no children i have no brothers no sisters so i'm not a father or an uncle i right.